Well, typically, if there is a fire, the question is, is somebody inside? How does the structure look like? And where are the sources of the fire, of the heat? So how does the heat distribution look like in the, in the environment? And this is something that we can sense with the fire drone. It has a thermal camera and it has an RGB camera and could have also other sensors such as oxygen and gas sensors, toxicity sensors and so on that can then get information on the structure of the environment and the toxicity and the heat distribution and like this get better situational awareness. So how we have built it is that we use aerogel, so it's a polyamide aerogel, which is something that is extremely lightweight and it has a very high heat resistance or the heat transfer coefficient is very low, so it's a very good insulator. We have also arranged it in, in a spherical um, geometry so that the heat transfer is low and we have integrated a CO2 cartridge that can cool down the internals of the drone where also then the motors are located.